Hello, you know who it is. So today I am filming or showing you a um, my thoughts and a live demo on this, which is the Voluminous Million Lashes um, Excess Mascara. And if you follow me on Instagram, I actually posted a picture of this followed by a picture of this. And this one is the Wet n Wild, I want to say, oh, Mega Volume Waterproof Mascara. It's said to volumize your lashes up to five times. The only difference is, is that this was $9 and then this was $2.99. Now, I wanted to show you guys a demo of this one on one eye and then, of course, a demo on this one on the other. But I was actually excited to try this one out because you guys know that my go-to mascara is actually from NYC. It's the one in the, um, the orange bottle. And there's also another one, Sky Rise, which is in a black bottle with um, purple writing that I absolutely love. And they're like $1.99. And hello, I love those. So I wanted to show you a live demo of this. So let's start with this guy. So first of all, I wanted to show you guys a um, view of the wand. And it looks exactly like the other Voluminous Million Lashes wand. My son just ran in here. Jay? Jay? Are you okay? Oh, you need help? Okay. You don't need help? He has to do rocks. This is my child running in from outside because he has to do rocks. And rocks equals... Anyway, <laughs> the wand is kind of similar to the other Voluma Slash wands. And I'll show you what that looks like. So here's the packaging for the original Voluminous Million Lashes Mascara. And this is what the wand looks like. Let's show you both of them side by side. This is the excess wand, the vo million, Voluminous Million Lashes <laughs> Excess Wand. And then this is the original. Now the only difference is, is this one looks slimmer and longer. But the bristles look pretty much the same. So I really don't know what, why this one is so awesome, but this one is supposed to be no clumping because it's supposed to be really tight to the tube so when you pull it out, it's supposed to kind of clean the bristles for you. So let's do a live demo. So right off the bat, with like one application, you can see that it is just automatically lengthening my lashes and curling my lashes which is nice. You can already see what it's done to my lashes already with one coat. So that's really good. I know for a fact that my original um, Million Lashes mascara doesn't do this kind of job with just one coat, so bravo. Now let's see the bottom lashes. pretty good. 
And you can definitely see that it does a good job in lengthening and volumizing my lashes. So now I'm going to open up my Wet n Wild mascara and apply it to this eye and kind of see the difference. This was really not the intention of this video, but I thought it would be great to kind of compare two um, drugstore mascaras that are pretty, you know, there's a big difference in price here, $2.99 versus about $10 or $9.99. I mean, let's try it. Let's see. Let's see what happens here. So this is supposedly supposed to give you natural looking, um, volumized lashes. And I love that. It's like right up my alley. So, let's open it up. I don't think there's any need to really, you know, read the back because it just, just a bunch of verbiage about how awesome this is. I, now this also comes with a waterproof color icon um, eyeliner, and this one was in pink fuchsia. I know the other color was in blue. So $2.99 with a waterproof, waterproof liner, which is, I mean, cool. And this is a pretty color. Can we, yeah, there it is. So, and it glides on pretty well. So that's cool. It's a cool little bonus. Thank you, Wet n Wild. This is what the wand looks like. Just a regular, you know, bristled wand. It's not silicone. Looks like it's plastic. Ugh, and it doesn't, it doesn't stink. But it has that like, it has a weird smell, but it doesn't stink. My technique is the exact same technique as when I applied the L'Oreal mascara. So I'm not doing anything differently. So this is what the um, Wet n Wild mascara did for my lashes. And this is in comparison to both. This is the L'Oreal, and then this is the Wet n Wild. I'm gonna apply it to the bottom lashes and see what it does for that. See my bottom lashes there. I would say this is definitely a lot more natural looking. I mean, a lot more natural looking. This looks a lot stiffer than this. And actually it is very, very like flexible. And it is dry because I have very little transfer to my finger when I you know, pass it through my lashes. But it doesn't give you the volume that the L'Oreal mascara gives you. And I'll show you the wands side by side just so that you can see the difference. Now this is the L'Oreal wand here and then this is the Wet n Wild wand. And you can definitely see the difference. This um, L'Oreal wand is a lot thicker and longer and it is silicone which is you know a lot better for volume and then this one is just a regular plastic wand with the regular spiraled bristles but if I had to choose my personal you know preference is natural looking lashes that are volumized and lengthened so I do love the mega volume waterproof mascara by Wet n Wild and just another look for you guys again
So that is the end of my demo for the Voluminous Million Lashes Mascara or Excess Mascara by L'Oreal and also a comparison in comparison to the Mega Volume Waterproof Mascara by Wet n Wild. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please show me by hitting the thumbs up. Don't forget to, of course, do that, comment, and subscribe to my channel, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!